Just about ready to get this one underway. Hanks and a couple other Demon Deacons lined up near it. We'll see who takes it. Ball sent into the back, headed in front, but an easy save there for Naylor. Notre Dame plays it back. Gatino to the left side. As Leah Clanky over there, who moves up. Clanky throws one, Lynch with the shot, and she scores! Just five minutes and 53 seconds in, and the Irish become the first team all season to score on Wake Forest in the opening half. With Clinky just settling down after working around the Wake Forest defense, and Lynch just times it up. She's just got great vision up there up front. Sees the open space. Clinky sees it too. One two punch. Andy Mertz of Pitt with five as well. Notre Dame back on the hunt for more. They work it into the box again. Lynch goes up for it. It comes to Roy, but she was unable to get a clean shot away. Got caught in between and... Yeah, just a missed timing there by Roy. I think she wasn't expecting it to just come right to her. Oh, space opens up here and it's walked in for a shot off the crossbar on a rising bid from Hanks. Kayla Hanks' shot. Man, what a shot left right foot. Time for this Irish team lean in points. Looking to add another one here. Throws it inside, scores! <laughs> another big goal from Ellie Osbeck as the Irish take advantage of the undisciplined Demon Deacons and make it 2-0 late in the half. Lines have always been getting open. This time it's Ellie Osbeck just coming on the near post front side of the ball. A great angle to that's kind of almost a tough shot to hit off the left foot, but Mercado though with a good read to force that one away. Cod fires a shot and stumbling down was Howard, but thankfully for Wake Forest, this shot went wide. Murphy was upset a moment ago there wasn't a foul call. Now it's the Irish fans who aren't happy that the whistle stays silent. Nice move here, and a low shot is stopped by Naylor, diving to her left. Looking to put Notre Dame Furley in the driver's seat here. She'll take the shot herself, bring it off the bar. Rebound available in front, and it's guided just wide. Better job for Wake Forest to get, get Marks covered, not allowing it. But nice job by Howard just to save it. This time, Wake Forest just keeps their head up, especially on their marks, always being aware of where the ball is, getting knocking that thing out. Lynch had the had the foot. FSU and UNC, that's... You need to make the most of the games that you can play at home, especially in the ACC. This game tonight so far for Coach Norman has been awesome. Great hustle there from Klinky to keep that one alive on the sideline. Won the battle, threw it in front. And the pass is just a little bit off the mark. Settled down on the outside by Mercado. She rips a shot, score! To put Notre Dame up by a three. Clinky just doing what she does best, just keep continuing to put the gas, put the pedal to the metal. And Mercado, she has really developed her game so far. I mean, look at that left foot shot. That's a beautiful kick that she just made oh into the back post right over Howard Howard just did the best she could will be a 3-1 final from Alumni Stadium tonight as the Irish took the lead about six minutes into this game and John they really never let up once they got going 